I mean, I'm I'm a fan of films, and uh, like, I have recently been doing a few campaigns for like films that I like. Now, I'm a, I'm a big fan of Idris Elba. I, wor- I met him once. I worked with him. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't hear that, but some woman was like, yeah. <laughs> and I want to say that's the first time I've heard that, but I put a picture of me and Idris Elba in my own family's WhatsApp group, and they were like, that's amazing. Well done, Idris. Like, what the fuck? I'm... <laughs> I'm your family. They were like, yeah, whatever. Anyway, what's it just saying? Blah, blah, blah. It's ridiculous. But <laughs> despite that fact, like, I, I think he's a cool guy. And uh, there was talk about him being the next James Bond. Now, uh, I don't know how you guys feel about that. But to be honest, it sounds like a great idea. But the more I think about it, you know what would be better than having our first black James Bond? How about a government that doesn't keep secrets from its people? That would be <laughs> fucking nice, too. <laughs> Aren't you fucking tired of the government now? Remember when, like... Like, you remember when spying used to be fun in like the 80s and stuff and there were like gadgets and lotuses and shit and now people are getting stabbed by radioactive umbrellas in Salisbury and <laughs> and spies are climbing into duffel bags by themselves and <laughs> committing suicide. <laughs> yeah, and then we found out that they were all like sending and washing and laundering their money in fucking Panama. Yeah, and then the government and shit stopped being fun. And also, even if we did have a black James Bond, he would still have a black family like me, and we don't trust government that much, which means he would be an outcast. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, like, I, my dad is an old Caribbean man who is almost 70, and, you know, despite that, he's real liberal. Just to give you an idea of how little black people trust the government, I could tell my dad, I'm gay. You know how I know? Because I sucked three dicks last night. And he'd be like, all right. I once said after watching Lethal Weapon, I want to be a policeman. He told me to go fuck myself. (laughs) That is how much (laughs) we (laughs) hate government. (laughs) (laughs) So James Bond is going to have a hard time when he comes home and he's like, all right, guys, it's me, James. I'm home for Christmas. What's up, snitch? (laughs) That's his uh, jealous brother, Jamarcus Bond. Uh, fuck you, Jamarcus. Now, fuck you, James. You so smart. You never come home with the lottery numbers. That's not how my job works, Jamarcus. You so fucking stupid, James, with your stupid tuxedo. What kind of black man wears a tuxedo? A butler. That's who, man. <laughs> <laughs> like, some other shit happens, but I don't want to spoil it, so you'll have to watch it, I guess. 